Hey guys, what's going on? Brofessor here, and today I'm going to be showing off a non-LEGO product. So over my uh, spring break that I had previously mentioned, uh, I visited New York and Washington DC, so I went to two pretty big cities here in the US, and um, obviously LEGO, pretty expensive, didn't have enough money to really get much of that, so I ended up picking up some of these sort of like, I guess you could call them knockoff LEGOs. Uh, they're called mini building blocks, and I just kind of wanted to show off uh, what they look like and give you a little like comparison uh, to a Lego. So without any further ado, if you do enjoy this video, don't forget to go down, hit that like button, uh, subscribe if you're new. Uh, I'm doing all sorts of Lego content, might do some more of these types of videos as well. And leave a comment down below letting me know what you think about this uh, sort of like knockoff Lego brand. Uh, so yeah, let's get right into it. So from left to right, I got uh, the Statue of Liberty, Alex Ovechkin, who is a Washington Capitals hockey player because I'm big into hockey, and I actually went to uh, the Capitals versus uh, Tampa Bay Lightning game that was up there uh, during that week. So I went to that game and got that. That looks pretty cool. Uh, then next to him, I got the Ellis Island, and then to the right of that is the Bald Eagle. Uh, if I was to tell you my favorite out of these ones, it would probably either be um, Ovechkin, just because I think he's really detailed, and uh, Ellis Island is also really nicely detailed. Um, something that is a little weird about these is just the pricing in general. Um, so the Ellis Island, you can see right there, it came in the box that was uh, right behind it, this box right here. Uh, it comes with a little under 700 pieces, uh, but actually only costs $8, as opposed to the Bald Eagle on the right which only came with 207 pieces, but cost $15. So I don't know if it's just where I was buying it or what, but the uh, pricing of these things is a little sporadic, which is interesting. Uh, but that's just one thing that I wanted to highlight. Um, I do think that they can be like their accuracy can vary. So obviously you can see uh, the bald eagle is probably like the mo one that most people would know. Uh, I mean, it's a pretty decent looking bald eagle. Like, I think it looks pretty nice. The wings are nicely made. They can move. Um, I'm not going to show because it's, uh, he does fall off this little like perch here uh, very easily. So that's one thing that I don't quite like about this one. Um, but the bald eagle is pretty detailed um, as opposed to uh, the Statue of Liberty here, which is something else that most people uh, would know. This book right here, or what's the, this brick that's supposed to be a book, actually comes off, which is also something I don't quite like. But you can clearly see here, like, the face just kind of looks a little weird on the Statue of Liberty right there. Um, I really wish that they could have potentially, like, I don't know, made it a little more accurate, which is definitely one thing that I prefer LEGO in, is overall accuracy. I think LEGO, in general, does do a very good job of really capturing whatever they're trying to make. Uh, so that is another knock on this thing. Uh, the, also, the stickers, so the Alex Ovechkin and the um, Ellis Island both had stickers, and the stickers aren't nearly as good as the Lego stickers, and I'm not really a fan of the Lego stickers, but I'm even less a fan of, like, whatever these stickers. Um, so yeah, that's not a thing that I don't really like about this. Uh, but yeah, overall, I just kind of wanted to show you guys uh, what I had gotten from that trip. I didn't really post much that week, and this video is also a little late. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what I got. And so uh, I may be doing some more of these types of videos. Like if I uh, end up going somewhere like over the summer, um, I might show off some of the things that I get. I'm also going to um, Disney this weekend in Orlando. So I'm planning on picking up some stuff at the Lego store. Um, and they also have the like little uh, chick pod promotion that's going to be going on. Uh, so yeah, I'm definitely going to be there this weekend. Uh, and hopefully I'll be able to pick that up. But yeah. That'll wrap up this video, uh, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.